I've been using Cursor to explore a number of Vibe Marketing use cases, and today I wanted to show you one that I thought was extremely cool, leveraging a couple MCPs, namely Data for SEO and Firecrawl. So before we get started, I'm gonna show you the finished product of what I built out in Cursor. To do this, I came up with a seed keyword, AI SEO tools. It was growing quickly. And then I expanded my research within Cursor using the Data for SEO MCP to identify a number of keywords that I could go out and rank for. So after I identified the keywords, I had Cursor built out a programmatic style website. And uh, here I focused on one priority keyword. I'll show you the individual programmatic style page in a second, but uh, let's take a look at the site. I thought that this uh, was very good. Uh, this is basically a one shot. I didn't have to go in and make any updates in terms of the flow or the design or anything like that. You'll see a number of SEO and LLM discovery optimizations here that I didn't have on the first go, like these FAQs and things of that nature. Um, we were able to implement those after I did the technical research that I'm gonna walk you through here in a moment. So uh, let's take a look at this collections page. I thought this was really nice. Um, side by side comparisons of the best AI SEO tools, real data, actual use uh, case studies and ROI calculators to help you make the right choice. So uh, this is the one that I actually built out. Uh, Surfer SEO versus ClearScope, compare the two leading content optimization platforms for SEO. So if we click into here, you can see the programmatic template that I built. I did a video on this last week and there are 1,247 other pages uh, which would be tied directly to keyword search opportunities that I could push live just like this one. And you can imagine if each of those pages get even just a trickle of traffic every single month, that's a significant amount of organic traffic that I could get to this website so that I could get leads, acquire customers, etc. So this is a very nice page. It's got visuals showing you know, uh, aspects of the, the user-generated reviews that I went out and collected. Uh, it's got screenshots that I pulled in uh, utilizing uh, the Playwright MCP. You can see all these feature-by-feature -feature comparisons, et cetera, et cetera. Now, this wasn't the first version uh, that I was able to build. I did a technical SEO audit using the Data for SEO MCP and the Firecrawl MCP to build out this optimization plan that really took this site to the next level. So, you know, I, I've been in uh, the digital marketing space for a while. I've worked with a lot of agencies. I've owned agencies. I can tell you that this technical and on-page audit and report is better than what most agencies uh, come up with. Uh, not to mention, I was able to do this in a few minutes, whereas, you know, it would take humans a lot longer to, to do that. So uh, let's read through some of this. I'll, I'll tell you what the executive summary says. It says, based on comprehensive analysis using Firecrawl and data for SEO, the site is a strong foundation, but it requires critical optimizations for both traditional search engines and LLM discovery. So when I wrote this prompt, I referenced those particular MCPs that I wanted to use. I shared the live production link and I said, hey, go and find opportunities both for LLM ranking and for organic search ranking. Um, Data for SEO uh, gave me an on-page score. It found a number of critical issues and uh, pr even prioritized which ones we should go and fix. So the critical SEO issues, missing meta tags and basic elements on the pages. So uh, it, it identified a number of home page issues, missing proper page title, no meta description, H1 has formatting issues, no canonical URL specified, there was a comparison page issue or two, generic title, missing meta uh, descriptions, no breadcrumb schema. Uh, there were content quality issues that Data for SEO discovered, low content uh, rate, low word count, poor readability scores. Um, the site was missing a schema markup, so there was no structured data on the pages. This is very important for SEO so that the, the Google bots and the LLM crawlers can go and understand uh, what is on the website. Uh, image optimization, so there weren't images on the homepage. There were uh, images missing on the sitemap. Uh, the images weren't optimized for core web vitals, which is another uh, measurement that Google uses to uh, get a gauge on how optimized your website is. So um, 
identified a number, a number of those issues. And then there were other high priority SEO opportunities, uh, title tag optimization, um, meta description implementations, uh, schema markup implementation. So those issues that were discovered, it actually went ahead and just created all of the implementations that you know we need to go and put into the website. It also did a content expansion strategy. So uh, it automatically came up with 800 plus new words of homepage content. Um, it added a number of other trust signals and testimonials, which is super, super important for SEO as well. Um, key sections to add, internal linking optimization, um, LLM opportunities. So it created and enhanced a LLM.txt uh, file. Um, and then uh, con conversational content optimization. It added Q&A style content, uh, FAQs that I showed you on the example uh, website. Semantic HTML improvements. Uh, and then it goes through a few other summaries. Mobile optimization is important. XML sitemap creation, robots.txt optimization. And uh, again, it kind of prioritized uh, the issues here. It even gave me a few uh, projections as to uh, what could happen uh, once these uh, things were actually implemented. Um, also, keyword targeting refinements and things of that nature. So. The, the point is that you can do a super in-depth technical SEO audit of your website right inside of Cursor with two MCPs. But the beautiful part about this was is that all I had to do to implement all of this in one shot was to tell the Cursor agent to go and optimize the site based on the AI SEO tool site audit document and push it to production. And that's it. That's how you can fully optimize your website for ranking on search engines within LLMs. Of course, you need to keep deploying high quality pages and high quality content, but these technical items will really help you uh, get those rankings and acquire the right kind of traffic to your website. Uh, hope you enjoy it. Let me know if you give this a try. I think this will save people a ton of time and a ton of headache just letting the AI do the heavy lifting. This is Vibe Marketing.